Hey everyone, welcome to Book Talk Tuesday, which is actually Book Talk Wednesday this week, um, purely because Monday was a holiday here and I can't get my days in order. Uh, I really uh, am excited to talk to you about this book I just finished this weekend. Uh, it is called The Missing Piece of Charlie O'Reilly, and it's by Rebecca Ansari. This is her first uh, novel, and to be honest, it blew me away. I'm shocked that this is her first uh, book because it sounds like a veteran writer that's been writing, and maybe she has, maybe she's been writing and writing for years, but it sounds like someone who's so well-versed and can really craft a really interesting story. So it's about this boy, Charlie, and he has a little brother named Liam, except he, well, basically a year ago, Liam disappeared, except no one remembers Liam, only Charlie. He only even, like, no one even knows he existed. No one has any memories of him. People just basically think Charlie's kind of weird about it and think he's a bit crazy because even though his mom and dad say that they didn't have a son named Liam, uh, so it all is very suspicious, and to be honest, at the beginning, I could not figure out, is this true? Who's telling the truth? What's going on? And then something happens, and it shifts gears a little, and I can't tell you too much more, except that this book, um, I wouldn't even categorize it in a genre, because it almost crosses over into various genres, and uh, I just, I don't want to tell you too much, but it's, it's so good. To be honest, I put it kind of aside on my nightstand and there's a few other books I got to first. And once I picked this up, I I honestly couldn't put it down. It was so well done and it just really kept me... Oh, my son's home. Uh, it really kept me intrigued because I honestly had no clue what was going to happen. Because of the cross kind of in genres, I, I couldn't quite figure out what was about to happen, but I really wanted to know what would happen. And I wanted to kind of experience everything that Charlie was experiencing. And he went through quite a whole turmoil of emotions. His best friend, Anna, actually believes that Liam existed, but even she doesn't remember him. But because she's such good friends with Charlie, she believes in him. And it's such a good story of friendship. I love that friendship between Charlie and Anna. And someone else comes along, and I love that friendship as well. It also deals a lot... Oh, my dog's feeling... My dog's actually kind of feeling sorry for himself because he went in my school bag about 10 minutes ago and ate a whole pack of licorice. So he's not going to feel very well later. Um, anyways, it also deals with Charlie's mom who has depression and basically how she's going through it, how Charlie's taking it, what the father is doing while it's all going on and how they kind of all cope separately and together with the things that have happened and or the things they think have happened. Um, anyways, it's a fantastic book. It's not going to come out until March, but uh, this you've got to put this on your list as a must read. So it's called The Missing Piece of Charlie O'Reilly, and it's by Rebecca Ansari, and Sari. And you got to wait for it till March. I think March 19th is his release date, but it's a fabulous one. Please pick it up. Please pre order it because that really helps out authors and tell everyone that this is a must read when it comes around to March. See you next time.